to see how we're due to have a really wet day. I want to see how the lambs are doing in the orchard. Those two are looking fine. The neighbors are very loud, bellowing cows. These guys look fine. Looking very good. And then, all these ladies are very clever and know about the shed and are sheltering their babies under the shed from the rain. Hopefully the babies will learn about the shelter and see there's plenty of grass. Okay, there's a nettle patch, but there's plenty, plenty of grass close by so that the yews can keep their babies protected. You're very loud. Look at you. Tippy top. Yes. Tippy tippy top protecting his territory. Oh, and there's a raindrop. Okay, I'm gonna go and get um, a feed trough to put in there to give a few nuts. Uh, I give a few nuts every once in a while just to get the sheep moving and galloping over and you can always tell who's healthy. Because with this kind of grass, I mean, it's very beautiful deep grass. So with feed trough and a few nuts, they always gallop over and you can see who's looking good. They're all looking good, despite the rain. We're due for torrential rains. So I want the lambing flock to get inside so they don't get soaking wet. Come on, girls. Atta girls. Come on. Atta girls. If I throw some of this in a feed trough, they're all going to crowd in. There. Now, they've all come inside. Now, all you guys... Whoop, I've got to put the lid back on here because it's already raining. Come on, girls. You've had your few nuts. They're just slightly damp. Look, bird shit. So what happens is birds land on sheep's backs and then pluck fleece to go uh, onto um, into their nests. Come on. Come on. Come on, girls, get inside. You have a lovely dry bedroom. The maternity ward. Come on. Come on. Go on. No, you stay out, Brindle. Don't come in and open the gate. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Judy. Yeah, you can get rid of your droplets out here. Now go on. Get in, Judy. Come on. Come on. Judy, come on. Good girl. 
Okay, sorry, you're now stuck with dry hay and a lovely bed of straw because it's due to get very, very wet. And this way, if you choose to lamb, the lamb will be dry and so will you. Loads of hay. Okay, job done. And you're due any minute now, aren't you? I think tomorrow is your first initial due day. Yes, it's wet and miserable out. Okay, got to put this away. And rake the yard of the loose straw. And then I can go and do something else. Hopefully you guys will produce some babies today. Some of you were very dew looking. <laughs>